Our office has grown very, very fast. Uh, we started, my partner, Fokker Mark and me, we started in the meanwhile 45 years ago, just one year after we finished our studies by uh, designing the new airport for Berlin. And from then on, we went through all kind of uh, architectural types uh, and we were engaged in nearly everything which needs architectural design, which needs uh, uh, ideas and which needs uh, communication between different cultures, between different uh, ideas and which needs a dialogue between the client and the architect. In the meanwhile, we have, uh, I think, more than 12 offices all over the world some of them in Germany, the main office is in Hamburg, the next one, other one, the second one is in Berlin. But we also have three, four offices in Asia, three in China, in, Ch in Beijing, in Shanghai, in Shenzhen, and also one in Hanoi. And uh, the new territory we are going for the future is South America. I've been before in Venezuela, in uh, Mexico and in Brazil, but we had any any client, any project here. But now, when the world competition in soccer will take place in uh, Brazil in uh, 2014, uh, we will have the opportunity to uh, create three different stadiums. I finished my my job as a professor in the university. We founded an academy, Academy for Architectural Culture. Uh, we are doing uh, different workshops with Chinese architects, with uh, Vietnamese architects, and now with, uh, on the other side of the world, with the Chilean, uh, starting from tomorrow. Uh, this is uh, an engagement uh, of myself. All the money comes out of our pocket. We are financing the whole academy because we are very successful and uh, we, said, we, we thought it is a responsibility of ours to give something back to the, to the society. It is a good mixture between profession, professional work on one side and uh, social uh, uh, communication with young people, with young architects. Three days before I was in Beijing, we uh, opened the National Museum of, of uh, China, which is the largest museum in the world, designed by ours. And uh, that is a very critical, politically, a very critical situation. But I came from, from Beijing via Hamburg, stayed one night there, and then to Dili. Architecture is the environment of human life. Not more and not less. It is the most, uh, one of the most important things. Uh, we have to take care that uh, our social life has a good environment, could fulfill the, 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 the goals, the idea, the uh, visions uh, on every level. So, and we as architects have the duty to take care for that and to do the best of it. Get into a dialogue with our society. They have to listen what our society needs, what, uh, what is the best to create uh, an environment we like to live in, to feel well, uh, even in, if we work, if we live, if we shop, are going for shopping or we have leisure. Every kind has to get the best, the best solution to feel, to give the feeling for the people uh, that they are, uh, they like it. The innovation is the seed of uh, what at least is growing up 
later on by the work of many, many people, many engineers, many architects. But it, it, in, the, in the very first initial point, you have to have an overall idea. And that is, that is the vision, in my opinion. There are two things which are important. One is the, the, the commercial side, and the other one is the side uh, uh, which gives us the uh, opportunity to, to fulfill our own ideas. I will I'll first mention to the second one, because uh, uh, in the relationship to all other experiences we had in, in the world, especially in Europe, uh, the possibilities to create no, new ideas and to do new things, uh, more regional architecture is much greater in, in China because they, it, it, is a, it is a society which is growing and uh, uh, there are many, many people who are uh, very open-minded to new ideas. That is, that is the uh, more important thing. On the other hand, uh, because China is uh, such a, a fast-growing nation, also on the, on the economical base, uh, the, that nearly 50% of all buildings which are built in, in the world in the next 10 years will be built in China. And what are the best solutions for our society? What are the, the most economic the simplest solution, uh, with, but everything has to have an overall uh, frame. It must be uh, included into a frame, not to do this, 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 this. So it must have uh, a philosophy in its own.